Hello, I'm Spade. This is going to be another of these CSGO Pro Positions videos, and we're going to watch Get Right playing mid on the new cache. This is appropriate for a couple of reasons. One, because of course the new cache is one of the maps in the Operation Bravo pack, and so we're now all playing it in competitive. And two, because on cache, mid control is extremely important. So, having a few ideas on where to play it from could be kind of useful. I think we're seeing Get Right, Get right feel a little trapped here at Sandbags. And sure enough, a nade ends it. Now what he's done here is he's pulled up into that right-hand corner to avoid getting spotted or peeked at the beginning since they had already smoked mid. That wall is completely spammable. So you can see he actually does a little damage there too. Clearly the team called him for B. So sandbags is an option. Playing back up there in that area is an option. You can also get up here and vent. And you see where he throws those nades. Those nades come right over towards the entrance to A main from T side. So he can flash people over there. And the nade didn't do any damage, but if somebody had been boosting up to, to peak mid, probably would have landed on them. Notice how he plays it very passively. He he peeks it slowly. And a quick getaway. He does this a couple of times. You can actually rotate pretty quickly from mid through vent all the way back around towards CT spawn and CT spawn mid. And what I thought was interesting here is rather than pushing back up into mid because he's low HP, I assume, he picks a spot right here near near the ramp to A site. It's a more passive angle but one that still covers mid so that the sites, sites A and B don't have to worry about someone sneaking around behind them without warning. He gets hit through the smoke there. That smoke he throws to mid is a pretty common one if you're playing CT side. Now I like that. He pulled out the silenced pistol to break vent, which tells the dragons that he is on the vent side, because normally what happens is when somebody breaks that vent, they're going to hide in it like he had done previously. So they're probably thinking, okay, we need to worry about the left side when we push out from mid. Directly over his head is where they would show up if they boosted over that side. But he sees the nade, so he knows. One thing I've noticed is in these pro matches, usually when you make a pick, if you can get out of the place where you just were, they do. Win. It helps prevent the trade. This round is not particularly imaginative in terms of spots. 
but it just demonstrates once again the ability to rotate from mid to B through vents very quickly. And that's a quick snapshot of Get Right playing mid on cash. Spade out.